see the picture of John seated in prison, arrested and defined because he challenged Mary the Tetrarch about Mary of Herodias, who was the former wife of his brother Philip. Perhaps John's confinement in prison helped to kind of preserve him from Herodias' wrath until that painful day when dropped on the promised the daughter of Herodias anything she wanted, even up to half of his people. And we know the rest of that story and recount this part, perhaps to look at the interior life of St. John during his prison confinement. The Gospel said that John heard about the works of Jesus and thus sent a message to the church to ask, are you the one? Or should we look for another? We might wonder, didn't John know he was the Christ? Hadn't John prophesied that he was the one? Had he said in another place, Behold the Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world? Jesus responds to John's question indirectly. By listing the signs that would accompany the Messiah. Go and tell John, he told the messenger, what you see and hear. The blind see, the lame walk, the lepers are cleansed. Blessed is the one who takes no offense at me. Why not a simple, yes, John, I am the Messiah. This leads me to think about what happened with the disciples. Remember how Peter proclaimed him the Messiah, and then at the point of, 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 of testing, he's in that courtyard during the trial, and he denies the Lord three times and leaves weeping. Or what about the other disciples? They were crushed at the death of the Lord, and so their response was to lock themselves away fear that they would be the next to be killed. What does this tell us? Why would John wonder if Jesus was the Messiah? And I think the answer is because faith is always our part, our first step in the revelation of God. 